Right then, guys, here we go. Triumph Stag. Uh, starts on the uh, on the key. Battery's flat. Uh, but um, but other than that, starts on the key. Sounds quite sweet. And wants a, a little bit of weekend work, really. Uh, a bit of tidying up, a bit of, um, bit of teacup, a bit of polish. Gap doors doesn't particularly fit that well. Depends, of course, on how good a one you want, doesn't it? You know, door bottom doesn't fit to the uh, to the sill there very well. Um, yeah, that's strange, that. Doors are brown, isn't it? Uh, it doesn't really fit to that front wing particularly well. Oh, they're bad gaps. Uh, but um, arches and things look relatively solid. Our top, of course, not too bad. Bright work. It's a user. It's a user. What's paint? It does want a coat of paint, really, to be right. But it's one that you could use the rest of the year, couldn't you? And, uh, and address it ready for next season. Uh, you know. So, it uh, sounded sweet enough. Engine sounded sweet. And, as I say, on the face of it, it looks relatively solid, the old car. Paint's just gone real flat, real dull. So, uh, not too sure about underside. Down under there. I'm sure you're going to find a few bits and pieces, aren't you? Odds and sods. But um, anyway, there she is. I think, um, as I say, she's probably going to be a, a, a runabout. And, uh, is she a bit tender in there, Mick? In there? Yeah. No, 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 don't pull it apart, no. So you're no doubt going to be into a little bit of welding <coughs> around the car, but I'm sure it's going to be priced accordingly. Interior-wise, as usual, Padding's gone in the seat there. 80,000 miles showing. Uh, not bad at all in there, really. So there you are. Pop along, have a little look underneath, and uh, make sure you're happy. But I'm sure it's priced accordingly. Thank you.